okay, our next step is what we did the last time. We want to put the wires back where they were originally. So I've, I've reconnected the wires back to where they were. And this is your reel, and it is attached to the crane by two bolts. What we need to do is remove these two bolts and gently turn the reel on its side without damaging the wiring. Now, this is right next to the cab, so you may want to put a piece of wood or some cardboard on the cab glass to keep from drop, stop from breaking the cab glass. What I need you to do next is pull this inner cover off of the reel. There are six screws holding it together. And inside the reel, you will find the brushes that allow the reel to turn. So what I need to do is make sure that these brushes move. They should spring up and down like you see here. They should be loose and free, both of them. Now these brushes have been lubricated, so they should be free. So once you're satisfied that the brushes are free and everything is up against here, I need you to take a small piece of of very fine sandpaper or steel wool and we need to go through and clean the contact rings on the reel. Move your hand so you see the contact rings. There you go. These are the contact rings. There's one here and there's one underneath it. They're brass colored contact rings. Once we have cleaned the contact rings, then we need to loosen this screw and push back until the brush is exposed. And you can see the brush. And just very lightly clean the contact surface on the brush. You can see it right here. You can see the brush moves nice and freely. Once the brush is cleaned, you can push it back into place. Sometimes it's a little bit hard. And then retighten this screw. The final step is to take a little bit of electrical contact cleaner and put it on a rag and use the electrical contact cleaner to clean the rings and to make sure all the that there's no corrosion on them. So once again a little bit more. At this point, once you're free, all your brushes are clean and the contact rings are clean, we're done. We can reinstall this cover and test the crane. At this point, the crane should work. You should be able to roll the reel and the crane would work with your wires and this should fix the problem. If it does not fix the problem, email me back and we'll go on to the next step.